Hi, welcome back to our channel and back to the tutorial for Python. If you like the channel, please subscribe and share with your friends. Share with your friends. And today we want to see the small project that is called Ticket Booking System in Python. So what is the use of this project? So if you go this project, you can say one more name that is Reservation System. It's a simple application where you can the user can access the system freely by just entering certain keys like a customer name, view the PNR status, and generate the total like this. So moreover, the contains the basic functionality in order to fill the operator and provide the custom needs. So the simple program, we are not using any TK enter or anything. If you want, you can just try with the TK enter also. Let's go for the program and execute it. Execute now. So, so I'm going to use the PyCharm. Here I'm going to write the program with a headline that is a print, that is ticket booking system. Then I'm going to give the term called restart is called Y. Then I'm going to write the method while well, restart of what no like that. And I'm going to write the program. So in this program, what you want, the main important thing is check PNR status. It will print some information and then ticket reservation. If you want ticket reservation, the user can enter number of tickets how many you want. If you give number two, uh, two means you can enter the two passenger two passenger details one by one like that if you give one you can enter only the one passenger detail so first of all if off then input enter option with the user we are the user can enter anything so if for the option one it will say you are paying your status in t3 like that by default if not if uh, if you enter two it will ask enter the number of ticket want you want suppose you give five it will generate five ticket and the information the custom passenger number if you give one it will print only one passenger information so and the details like uh, important is a name age sex and uh, so on then we are writing the uh, we are going to call the function called uh, for p in range of people then we have to give names code to str of input of name similarly age and uh, you have to enter male or female and uh, you can give up and method for sex also then you can go restart that is str is called input of did you forget someone if you give yes what will happen it will go for restart if at all no, not if you go no, nothing will happen. You just print the name. Okay, then else x code zero. Then we are writing total ticket. That is how much how many tickets you register like that. And you give for p in range, we are calling the function. Then people plus one. Then it will be information like a ticket, name of the passenger, age, sex, what, what are the user enter. The detail will be saved and printed the at person. So this is the very simple project. We can execute very easily. Do you want to execute anything on the move? Yes, you can do in Python ideally or Jupyter anywhere. So let's go for execution here. So if for a successful executor, it ask the option, you can give one or two. So just I'm giving the one. When I go option one, it will by default will say, your PNR status is T3 like that. Once again, I'm closing, I'm running, because I had to show the number of tickets. So don't worry, the screen may run somewhat fast. You can see slowly. So I'm going to give option number two. That is regarding what ticket reservation. So is asking now enter the number of ticket white. I want to just press one. That means one passenger information I can give one by one. So if I'm going to enter name, just assume that I'm going to give the name as John and is asking the information of age. I'm giving 24. Then ask the male or female. I'm giving just M. Then it uh, like that is that it asking forget one. Yes, I'm saying no. When I give no, it automatically take the data and start to print so just in here so here you can observe here so if you go here it's observe so what are the how many information given only one passenger so it's saying total that is total ticket number one and uh, ticket uh, number or something one and uh, print is name and yes 24 and mail so like that you can give and reserve for the number of tickets as much you want this is all about ticket booking system very simple one uh, just using the function only if you are a beginner, it, the video will be useful for you. And uh, thank you for watching the video. If you like the video, please subscribe and share with your friends. Thank you.